For first creation today, we have the blister back. Uh, it's some kind of giant mech attack spider beetle thing. I'm not entirely sure, but I think it's supposed to be able to fly, and that sounds horrifying, so I thought we'd check it out. But before we get into the horrifying nature of this beast, let's go ahead and take it for a nice little walk through the park here. To our right, we see a bunch of potential victims. To our left, we see a, a jungle gym. That seems like fun. So much potential for fun and destruction. Which one will I choose? Uh, I don't actually see a weapon control for this guy, so let me go ahead and try to press a couple of buttons here. Yep, alright, I found it. That was easy. And as I said, I think this thing is able to fly. I see a bunch of propellers in here. I don't know if that is part of the flying or, or what that is exactly, but let's go ahead and try to fly here. Uh, I believe it is right shift to fly. Oh, we're taking off, and the legs get tucked up in like that. Oh, this is, this is very horrifying. And I believe in the air, it turns to arrow key controls. Yep, that seems, that seems right. All right, let's go ahead and uh, try to do something bad. Man, I'm such a good boy. I don't even know how to be evil. How, how, how do I do this? Do I do I just aim up here and shoot something? Okay, I can do that. All right, we don't really have a camera for inside, I don't think. Let me go ahead and press. Oh, oh we do have a couple of cameras here. Oh, and there's that one there. Uh, none of these are very helpful to shooting things, though. So we're going to tilt back like this, and we're going to try to line this up. Where's that gun at? It's right there. That should be perfect for that statue right over there. And we're gonna shoot, rub up, up, uh, oh, and it's not gonna hit even close. I mean, it probably would have hit if it was on the correct plane. All right, then let's go ahead and try this again a little bit closer and try that there. Oh, come on, and let's aim a little bit like that. Aim up a tiny bit. Oh, it's gonna hit, it's gonna hit, it's gonna hit. Oh, come on, hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh, are you for real, man? Aim up a little bit higher, a little bit higher, and how about that? Come on, hit it. Nah, damn it. It's so hard to get an idea of where it's actually flying to. Oh gosh, okay. Uh, let's try to aim up a little bit like that. And then over, over a tiny bit like that. Here we go, come on. We're gonna hit it. Oh, something I noticed is I don't really know how to uh, stop or go down. I think it's right control to go down. So yes, to go down, you actually transform back into the spider form. And then if you want to go back up, you can just tuck your legs back up in and you're fine. All right. Let's go ahead and try to turn again and shoot this freaking thing. Uh, don't mind all the cannonballs down there. This is totally my first attempt. Okay, how about something like that? Right there. Yeah, right in your face. Yeah, I got him. First shot. Uh, totally not uh, the millionth time. Yeah. Man, this thing's cool as crap. All right, let's go ahead and get down here, back on the ground, and see if we can do a little bit more destruction and damage while we're down here. Oh, no, they're onto me. All right, that guy's moving. Uh, let's see what kind of different cameras we have in here. See if any of these are actually usable. That it just doesn't seem that you know I, I think we'll use it out here this guy's on to me okay we had to act fast all right let's go ahead and try to aim ourselves up a little bit here aim down and then oh back up oh and shoot oh get the guy coming close to me oh i'm taking out your houses yeah take that uh oh the guy's getting too close what do i do hit him come on now get him <laughs> oh gosh oh i'm not very good at aiming this thing okay what do i do oh he's getting too close okay you know what we have to resort to stomping over him that's all we can do at this point we have to hope that he doesn't take us out as we as we go over oh he took himself out he just kind of fell over there oh crap i forgot to put down the wet floor sign right ah oh, no now he's gonna sue me oh he's coming up behind me oh he's gonna do some kind of badness to my backside that's not cool oh no they're all circling me my time is limited uh, let me just try to shoot a little bit more. Do as much destruction as I can before I die. You're not going to take me that easily. I'm actually surprised we're able to outrun them as long as we have, but unfortunately, we have gotten caught up on a rock, and the rock is going to be our defeater. Yep, that seems like that's pretty much all we can do. But yeah, this thing's pretty cool. I, I don't know exactly what it's supposed to be, just some kind of uh, attack vehicle, mech, spider flying thing. Again, not really sure, but... It's cool, and it shoots stuff. I like that. For our next creation, we have the VLS Cruise Missile. Now, this is a missile that we are able to fly around and pilot as as like a plane kind of thing, and then we can blow it up. I don't know, it's supposed to be cool. Just, just, just watch. Now, before we launch this thing, let's go ahead and check out some of the different controls real quick. We do have a camera, so we can get inside here and look around. Oh, there's even a timer up there. Shows our gun over on the side, all kinds of orientation. We got west over there, got north straight ahead and apparently there is a seeker mode which i'm not entirely sure what that does but it just made it blow up so i'm guessing i wasn't supposed to press that yet and also another cool thing is that when you do start it off it kind of lifts up on its own here very cool i i don't know just something about it satisfying i think we're ready to go it is t f g and h to pilot this thing around once we're in the air and we'll just see what happens here let's launch it and 
hand it's going to turn a little bit and then oh what's happening i'm not sure it's flipping around oh and there goes that uh is this supposed to be happening i'm not sure oh oh now it's flying okay <laughs> oh there it goes okay i should probably get inside and try to pilot it oh man what are we doing i don't know so i want to try to bring it back around oh oh i can't pilot it i can't i can't control it ah. <laughs> All right, that, that went about as I expected. Can we get outside and see what happened here? Where, where did we even go to? I mean, hey, we, we flew pretty far. That's that's a, an accomplishment, right? Now that I know how this thing actually works and which part to be toggled onto, let's go ahead and try that again. Uh, let's go ahead and hop right inside, just so we're fully prepared. And to blow up, it looks like it is B, so I think we can control that at any point if we want to. All right, let's go ahead and try to fly down. Why is it not? controlling. I think flying from outside is going to be a little bit easier for me considering I'm not a very good pilot and all that good stuff. It actually flies pretty well. It's not super responsive, but it, it, you can you can put it where you want it. Let's go ahead and try to blow up this tower real quick. Ra -ba 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 -ba. I mean, hey, that, that worked pretty well. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, we even got some stuff over there blowing up too. Nice. Now I wonder if we can launch it while we're not even uh, fully erect yet. And it seems like, yeah, that's no problem. Cool. Oh, but yeah, this thing is super fun. I could do this all day. Oh, wait, it seems like we're flying this way this time. And we didn't drop off the red. Uh-oh, is this bad? Uh, it must be, because, oh, we're blowing up. I also noticed that the wings didn't open that time either, so I think you have to wait for it to be fully up before you launch it. And then, yeah, then everything works as it should. Except this time it actually isn't working. I have launched it, but it's not taking off. Do I have to press it again? Oh, duh, I was pressing the wrong button. I don't know how, but I was pressing J, so... Yeah, don't press that button, because apparently it breaks things. Weird. So at what point do the wings actually flip out? I think after the two red bits get blown off. But this time they didn't even get blown off. Oh, there goes one. And we only have... Yeah, the wings aren't out yet. How... What, what do I do? Ah! Oh, there they go. Okay. I, I'm a little bit confused, as you can tell. We gotta spot out a potential target. I'm thinking one of the villages. Uh, possibly the mountain village over here. I don't think... Yeah, we don't really destroy them often enough. You've had too much time to rebuild since the last time. Oh no, but I'm not able to steer. Ah, come on now. No, no, no. Darn it. And I have to do the whole flight again to even attempt it. I mean, I got one of the houses somehow. That's got to count for something. Let's go ahead and try this one more time. Oh, oh crap. We're going too far away. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Ah, <laughs> get back here. Oh gosh. Uh, there's so many trials and tribulations to besiege that people don't even see, and, and uh, I just, <laughs> I'm struggling the entire time over here. We're up in the air, we're pretty much right above the village. Let's go ahead and try to aim down a little bit like that, and then come down. Oh, perfect. Yep, it's gonna be perfect. Come on now, hit, we're directly in the center. Boom. Yeah. Take some of that, and a little bit of this. Heck yeah. Yeah, this thing's just so much fun, I could probably play with it all day. I mean, it's, it's basically a plane with a bomb attached to it. Uh, that's everything I've ever wanted. Let's go ahead and blow it up one more time here, if we can, right against the ground. I don't even care. D just another explosion, to just to make me feel more powerful. Yep, it worked. <laughs> and for our last creation today, we have the steam-powered war engine Gorgonaut. Now, I do want to go ahead and say, right off the bat, it is massive, and there are a bunch of moving parts, so it is going to be quite laggy, and a little bit frame droppy, but I still wanted to check it out, because look at it. I mean, come on now. It's super steampunky and war machine-y. I just absolutely love it. I, ha I have to check it out. But we are going to try to push through and check out all the different features of this guy. So starting off with, we can ignite the engine. Let's go ahead and do that and see what all is happening back here. Oh, oh, I see a bunch of flames and water and all kinds of whatnots going on. What the heck, they went and put titty jets on the war machine again? Now in all actuality, it seems to make it run much worse and it, I can't really see like what the heck is going on inside of here anymore. So yeah, don't turn on the engine. Also, I'm trying to move him and I don't think we can actually move. I, I think he might just be like a sculpture type of build. I might be entirely wrong on that, so I'm sorry to the builder if it is actually mobile, but I'm pressing all kinds of different stuff and it's not doing anything. Oh, it just moved a little bit. Are, are you moving? Do you want to move for Wolfo? Huh? No? All right then. Oh, I do see some stuff moving back here. So something is moving. I'm just not entirely sure how to move the tracks, but that that's fine. Oh, and I hear something breaking. Oh, oh the head is falling off. Oh, was that happening the whole time? Was I doing some kind of head control making it fall off? Probably. 
well crap. I'm looking over in the build description and the builder himself said it's pretty bad at actually doing anything besides looking cool. So yeah, I guess that's pretty much all it's going to do here today. That's fine with me. In the past I wouldn't really show builds like this where they don't really work that well and I can't really uh, show them as some kind of operable frame rate. But I think for this one, I'm going to make an exception just because of how absolutely insane he is. I mean, look at it. It's a steampunk war machine. Who doesn't love those? I've realized a lot of the siege is just rolling with the punches, working with what you got, and, and that's what I tried to do here for y'all today. Uh, so hopefully you did enjoy. If you want to check out any of the creations for yourself, the links will be down below in the description. Uh, but again, thank you all so very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And just know that I do always try my best to give you guys the best show that I can. So e even if things are not working well, it, it, just just know that I'm trying. Okay? Okay, great. Uh, here's some other videos. Go watch them. I would appreciate that. Take care. Goodbye.